Hi, welcome back to my channel. So fresh face today, no makeup on apart from a bit of mascara. And I'm going to show you how to use this Jade Precision Tool. You can get this at my website shop, faceyogaexpert.com, with some Fusion by Danielle Collins Moisturizing Serum. So we're going to apply this to the skin and I'm gonna show you how to help your skin look lifted and sculpted natural. So applying this all over my skin, I already have quite a bit on my skin, so just applying a little bit more, taking a breath as I breathe in this beautiful aroma. It's all organic, accredited by the Soil Association, vegan, cruelty-free, non-greasy, but it gives you that glide that a moisturizer wouldn't to help you with tools and with facial massage. Okay, so it's all over my face now. I'm going to get my Jade Precision Tool now, and I'm just going to very gently come underneath my ears, and I'm just going to move downwards. So we're just doing this to help open the lymph nodes, a little bit of lymphatic drainage here, and then the other side slowly moving down, breathing deeply as you do this. Wonderful. Okay, so now we're going to use this a little bit differently to a usual gua sha because we're going to work on precision areas. So now I've opened the lymph nodes, done a little bit of lymphatic drainage. I'm going to work this area, marionette lines and nasal labial folds. So taking the tool and I'm going to do little actions all the way up. Now you'll find that redness comes into my skin quite quickly here. And just breathe really deeply as you do this. Obviously I'm talking but what you would do is you would have your lips closed and just breathe in and out through your nose as you do this. And this is helping to boost the blood circulation. It's also helping with any stagnant energy. So when we've got stagnant energy or in Chinese medicine qi, in yoga we call it prana. If that's really stagnant, then often this shows up as stress in the face, lines and wrinkles. So we're just helping that energy to move a little bit here, but also bringing that fresh blood and oxygen to the skin surface. So yes, it's exaggerating any line for a moment, just because the redness is coming, but in a few minutes that will go down and I'll notice that air is a lot plumper and firmer. Okay, I'm gonna do the other side now. I might swap hands for this one. Moving upwards. Really, really relaxing as you do it as well. Feels like a little self-care moment. I definitely recommend getting these, even if you've got a regular gua sha, it just goes that little bit deeper into the skin. You can really get particularly into any lines that are bothering you. So these sort of smile lines. And in a minute, I'm gonna show you a couple of other areas which I love using this on. You can really use this on any line, to be honest. It also works really nicely if you have an acne spot. Don't go over any acne spots with it, but you can just, so imagine there's a spot there. You can just go around the area just to boost that blood circulation. Okay, so I've really worked in that area now. You can see that redness, that pinkness there. Let's go on the eye area now. So I've already helped opened up the lymph nodes there. So now I'm going to just work underneath the eye, much lighter touch than I did on the laser labial fold and the marionette line area. Just moving out to the hairline, I'm gonna come underneath my eye here. Lovely glide all the way across and then above nice and gently using the breath this is really lovely for helping to sculpt the eyebrow and you can do this with a regular gua sha but i really like doing it with a precision tool it just means you're getting exactly where you want to do it and you really feel how it's just getting a little bit deeper into the muscle and you can always see that sculpt happen as i do it okay so let's do the other side so very good for reducing any puffiness in that area, any dark circles here as well. Deep breaths as you do it. And then above, nice and gently. Good. OK, 
Okay, so now we've done that, we're gonna work this area between the eyebrows, so on frown lines. So we've done smile lines, we've worked eye bags, and we are going to do this area for frown lines. So you're gonna use the tool at this angle, I'll slightly turn to this side so you can see it. Then you're just gonna work upwards. So working upwards. So I'm using this sort of rounded edge here working up with now very quickly this is going to go quite pink in this area very normal as long as you don't feel here any pain which you shouldn't do and as long as you don't obviously break the skin doing this you just want to go quite gently now I do have quite a lot of moles around that area so I do have to go quite careful and sometimes I just come slightly out to the side as well and I like to go just above the eyebrows I tend to get sort of prone to sort of smaller lines along there. So I find just by moving outwards like this, it works beautifully. Okay, and then we're just gonna finish just by going back down, a little bit of lymphatic drainage, let's do two each side. Okay, and we're all done. So your Fusion by Danielle Collins and this, you can get at faceyogexpert.com. Have a great day, bye-bye. Yeah.